Podcast. I'm your host, the Black of the Berry, the Sweet and Juice. Oh, that's it. Oh, okay. <laughs> Boy, Mike, it, man. Boy, 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 Mike, aka Boo, aka Choke Yourself, aka Reese Pieces. Hey man, you know, with this, this episode of My Speaker Podcast, we're just going to go ahead and hit you with our slogan, you know what I'm saying? We may not always be right, we may not always be wrong. I always got my opinion what we're speaking on. Hey man, you know what I'm saying? It's that time of the year, you know, bean picking what, you know what I'm saying? You know, we both work for the post office. It's hot out there, you know what I'm saying? My boy here can't stand the heat, you know what I'm saying? Me, I'm born in the south, you know what I'm saying? I, I'm used to this weather, man. This, this my type of weather, man, you know what I'm saying? Hey, he, uh, Where do you think I was born at? He was born in Master House. I was born out there in the field, you know what I'm saying? But anyway... Uh, <laughs> you see who Master Cully is over here too. Yeah, That's why he got that sunblock. Yeah, master, man. He got worry, a, he got an automatic man. sunblock. Don't I don't have that sunblock. It's hot out here. He likes skinning it, man. Hey, but he going, he telling everything. You know what I'm saying? It's hot. He sure is. He, he, he ain't picking, he ain't picking nothing. Hey, he snitching on everybody. I, I, I definitely am sitting on the porch telling on everybody. Hey, drinking mint julep with Boss and all that stuff. Really? Okay. All right. But anyway, we gonna come with. We gonna this episode is gonna be about entertainment. We gonna be talking about a couple of movies that. Starring Eddie Murphy in the, in the cast of other people, but we just picking out three movies that we're gonna uh, match my co host here, my partner here. Which movie, what's the best scene out of each one of these three movies? Life, Boomerang, Harlem Nights. Out of, out of uh, life, what you think is the best scene out of that movie? I mean, it's, it's an all time favorite, no matter what. That's like, my all-time favorite movie. But if you mm-hmm. want to say a scene, you know how hard it is to say a scene in that movie. There's so many, but well, I mean, everybody would know the scene. I'm gonna laugh at. It ain't even the cornbread scene. It's the watch scene. The watch scene. Yeah, it must. Hey man, <laughs> he said, "Hey man, yeah." He said, "I lost my daddy. Watch, man." He said, "Man, my daddy, watch, man." He said, "Man, he said, say, man. He said, say watch one more game." <laughs> He said, I'm going to knock all your friends out. He said, you can't even say watch right. You can't even say little clock around me. He said, you say, I'm going to just dive on you. That muscle, that's, that's like the funniest scene if you want to say a funny scene. But then you can say the scene when they were old there, when they were sitting there. And saying? he would say, um, what he say? He said, man, listen. He said, I'm going to just bust up in the motherfuckers. The upper room. Wingy. So it, I mean, life has so many. It, so that would make man. that movie is a classic because classic movie, man. every scene in that movie is a classic. But if you had to narrow, it, tell me one, I had to, it had to be the watch scene. Yeah, exactly. Cause when he watched that scene, when he got, he, he came back down. Mm-hmm. Cause you know, before he said that, <laughs> he said, well, "Where was you at?" He said, "What? Well, you still got them two dollars?" He said, "Nah, right. you know, I just gave it two dollars." He said, "Oh, you up there doing law work?" Yeah, law work, man. He said, "Okay." Lord, he said, "Why you up there doing law work?" Getting, he said, I got that, you got pimped me though, so you know, yeah, farm boy, yeah, like. farm boy, they got me out here. They like beat them up, them socks. They beat them down to a socks. <laughs> when he said that, he said, "Man, forget the money. He ain't even bought the money. It's, I love my daddy watch." Yeah, I feel your daddy watch. When man. he said that right there, I lost it. So that had to be the best scene in that movie, by none. Mm-mm, man, by hey, none. Hey man, me man, it's so many in that, in that movie too, man. But when they got man, when they got locked up, man, when they were in camp eight, man, with hopping ball, man. Hey man. <laughs> hey man. Who them is? They, 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 don't, they don't sound different around here. They're from New York City, boy. That one, they too. Don't worry about it. I ain't nice like boss. I'll slap the black off your ass. Yeah, you know what you say? Yeah. Hey, tell me about Camp 8, man. Hey, man, Camp 8 run from sack to sack, bird to bird. You know what I'm saying? You run and follow Huffin' Bob, you run and follow me. Hey, <laughs> and when he said that little laugh, man, I said, man, why he got to be bumping like that? I ain't nice like boss. Oh. I said, yeah. Yeah. But then another part is, uh, <laughs> man, you got so many now, man. I ain't, I can't even, I can go on and on about that movie, man. Hey, so, man, what about biscuit, man? Biscuit trying to make it to the game. Hey, man. man. Biscuit, man. Where you going, biscuit? I can't go back home to my mom. <laughs> Where you going, biscuit? <laughs> and see, another scene in that movie that people stop now and look at me. He say, I got the letter. He looked around and say, any of y'all fella read? Yeah, I can read. What you mean? Last fella who read was hit by what? 10, 15 years ago. <laughs> can't none of y'all read. Then he looked at the old man. Old man say, <laughs> Shit, the old motherfucker not to read. He said that man, I'm like man, he just you right there in front of the dude, so you can't read. Yeah, so that was man. that was a funny scene, man. So I mean, that movie to me yeah, is man. a classic. No matter what, that's an all time classic. Hey man, cl- classic man, classic man. Which one? Hey man, who? Which one? Your name Tiny man. <laughs> hey man. <laughs> so this so. <laughs> So I guess what was next one you say Hall of Nights? Yeah, Hall of Nights, man. And make sure y'all comment too. Give us comment in the uh, in the comment section. What are y'all one of y'all favorite scenes in 
in the life movie. You know what I'm saying? Hollow Knights got a bunch too, but I mean, the one that jump out to me is the one that jump out to everybody. What, man? He say, <laughs> you, you ready? Shh, yeah, I'm ready. He say, Shh. You about, you about to be a rich. He said, come. He said, come. And then what made him funny? Richard Pryor was looking. He said, well, come. He said, he said, I. And Richard Pryor, I, I, I'm knocking somebody. You know what I'm saying? He said, I, 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 it took a while. He said, I finally got it. He said, come on, baby. Yeah, he said, come on, part, baby. I said, that man, listen. Well, he put the S on and my part. thing is, he only had a few scenes, but that scene right there. Classic. That that was a funny one. Come on, baby. Yeah, come on, baby. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he had two. He said, he said, I seen that boy about thirty-two Ooh. rounds. I was like, thirty-two. Come on, Ooh. man. Yeah, see, but like I say, you know, classic man, classic material, man, classic movies from from Eddie Murphy. And, um, in in Hall of Nights to me, oh, that the easy one for me. With uh, with uh, Arsenio. <laughs> he told me with the gun yeah. scene. Pow, pow. He says, don't Stop shoot it. it. Stop it, don't shoot that. Don't shoot that. Don't shoot that no more. I said, man. I know you see the quick. I told y'all I didn't do that, man. I know you saw my brother Chris. <laughs> <laughs> I know you saw my brother Chris. He said that, man. He said, if you sound just like him, he said. <laughs> you sound just like him. And when he said that, man, I was like, yo. But that movie, I mean, it's a classic too. But it's just, I guess that when he made, if I'm mistaken, Hall of Nights came out way before Life. I think so. Did, yeah, when he yeah. made Hall of Nights, that mm -hmm. was classic. But when he came out Life, mm -hmm. Life is like the ultimate. ultimate. So I mean, you know, and then when you say Boomerang, Boomerang, you got to sit and think about it. But I guess the scene that made me laugh the most, most people say the pop scene when he had the lining, coordinate and all that kind of mm -hmm. stuff. But to me, I think the funniest scene to me is when. Um, him and David Allegria and Eddie Murphy was in there. They was exercising, and they were doing like this. And he mm -hmm. said, "Man, you know he having a problem getting." It. And Mark was teasing him stuff, and they would start <laughs> rolling. So that what made me laugh when they were sitting there talking like that. But just Eddie Murphy, I guess alone. The Mark scene, you know, with, 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 uh, with you know what? It wasn't even so much that scene. It was the the, the uh, Butler. When he yeah. came, he walked out, he be yeah. snickering and stuff. Mm -hmm. He looking at him like, "Yeah, I know what you about to." Mm -hmm. So it just. You gotta watch little small stuff in scenes like that. Catch, yeah, the catch and stuff like that. But yeah, um, Eddie Murphy is one of the, one of the comedic geniuses of our of our lifetime. Um, For sure, he know how to make great movies. He know how to pick the cast to make great movies. Like I'm saying, and they always seem to have like a good time on set. You know what I'm saying? They, man, imagine them making life, man. You know. No, I. I like, you know what I said? If I if like I got something. You, you can either give me a million dollars or let me just be on the set of life. I just exactly, get, don't even want the money. Let me be on the set because I know they laugh all, all day. All day, all day. Because you know Bernie, Bernie says some stuff. Bro. I know they had to have fun. Rest in peace of Bernie. And then if you ever watch the outtakes, yes. When he did the outtakes, if bro. I don't know if y'all ever seen the outtakes, go pull up on YouTube and watch, watch the outtakes. The outtakes. Why the outtake with him and Bo Keem sitting there? He said, hey, man, you motherfucker retarded. Come on, play these cards. And Bo Keem started laughing. I said, man, Eddie Murphy is a fool. Hey, but man. it just, Eddie Murphy, I think, is, like I say, all time, he's an icon. And icon. we just talking about those three movies. We ain't even talking about Beverly Hills Cops. Trade we ain't talking places. about Norbert. Norbert. We ain't talking about Trading places. places. I mean, this guy has got 48 hours. 48 hours yeah. So he got so many movies that you can just name that's just been, but like I say, he's, he's like, our modern day version of what's what's the character back in the days, like Richard Pryor, Richard Pryor. for us. Mm -hmm. and Richard Pryor for us is basically like would be something like how you my your, our mom and I. Yeah, because, because yeah, Richard yeah. Pryor, Bill Cosby, them kind of like the seventy eighties. They had it on lock. Yeah, so yeah, they had that on lock. Mm -hmm. Eddie Murphy is what we saw in the nineties, mm -hmm. and he kind of took 90s, over. Yeah. And he mm -hmm. just he he's he's an icon. He's a genius. And mm -hmm. like I say, I don't think there's no other way to say it, but he's just a genius at what he does. Yep. And that's why I think he really don't put out movies as much because I think he puts a lot of time and effort mm -hmm. to think about, think about what, what am I going to do yeah. because when I do something like Norbert, mm -hmm. when when I first seen the previous of Norbert, I thought it was going to be hot garbage. I said, man, he going to be mm -hmm. playing. But once you saw it, when he did Rasputin, yep. and I'm like, bro, that was just a whole mm -hmm. nother. Mm -hmm. She was a she was an icon by herself. So, so just yep. it's, it's a funny, but like I say. Because he had, he, okay, so he did Norbert. He had, what, that's the movie he had too with the, um, Doctor Doolittle with the animals. Yeah, that's, yeah, a, that's a that's a that's a. Um, I mean, he did that like two or three. Oh, they should have stopped. Maybe Janet one. Jackson was in one of them or whatever. 
Oh no no you talking about you talking uh, about the clumps the clumps you talking, you talking about uh uh Doc Doolittle then you had the uh, Doc Doolittle is with the animal you talking yeah. about uh, uh, uh Professor uh yeah you yeah. talking about when he was a Buddy Love when he Buddy Love yeah yeah, yeah yeah I forgot about that so yeah. that's not a classic so classic man. yeah I mean but he makes he makes movies mm-hmm. and like I say I get honestly to say you can't really say I don't know if I can say a movie one of his movies is a dud I really don't I don't know one of his movies like ah oh, that wasn't that good or it might have been you know kind of. Now I think the only one he probably had when he was the words he, he couldn't talk after so what's the name of the movie when the tree was falling all uh, uh, of throughout the movie he played like a uh, he could all the words after why he couldn't say with so many words word. I forgot the name of that movie but it was like eh. but you know but like I said Eddie Murphy is a classic man I mean, he's all time all time one of the best you yeah, know I'm gonna do it yeah. that's just like saying Denzel. Yep. Samuel, mm-hmm. we can do this one on a, a, a play. Even play even Will even Will Smith, yep. much as you know, whatever the, 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 the what happened with him in the grant, Will put out great movies. Yeah, every, everybody so, have a bad day, you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. I said, that was his bad oh, day. That he, night. Had bad yeah, he had a bad one. He was just a public, eh? It's just a public bad day that night. You yeah, know what it, it, real public. Yeah. I guess it was bad for Chris that day too, wasn't it? Yeah, it was bad for Chris too. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, man. man. You know, everybody, everybody had their little, you know, ups and downs, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but, you know, it is what it I is. I think Chris got a lot of that up. I don't think he got a lot of down that day. Yeah, he yeah, he, he almost got down that day. <laughs> he, he almost got down that day. But, <laughs> but, yeah, but, I mean, you know, so if you want to sit here and, like I say, um, Go real, like, real quick, what, what would you say Denzel top three movies are? Denzel got some hard hitters, man. But I'm saying, what's your I, top I, I'm three? I'm trying to think. Definitely Training Day is one of them. I mean, Training Day, I would go with, um, man, I love the man, um, Negoti- uh, what, but he played the, um. No, 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 no. Negotiator. Negoti- uh, that's Samuel Jackson. That's Samuel Jackson. The one that, the one that he done made the third one was the last one. Equalizer. Equalizer. And, um. You know what, man? I'm, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go kind of left field on this, man. Right. Well, he played with um the other movie he played. Uh, shoot, what's that? Two Guns? Oh, you talking about what? Mark Wahlberg? Yeah, it was alright. Yeah. But like I say, me, my all time no, favorite movie is Equalizer. They just oh, my bad, my bad, my bad. I'm sorry. No, take out Two Guns. Give me um. The one where he, uh, Book of Eli. Nah, I still ain't that. Oh, that's the Book of Eli. Listen, yeah. for me, it's always going to be Equalizer. Mm-hmm. It's always going to be Remember the Titans. I don't care what nobody says. That's yeah, one of that's my favorite movie, all-time man. movies. Great Remember movie, the man. Titans. Great movie. And then I would say, oh, Man of Fire. See, all, all he, got, movies, he got man. classics. Classic, he got classics. Man. You can't go wrong. He got no classics. Man. Oh, I'm sorry. Take Man of Fire. Give me John Q. I was going to say Give me John Q. I was going to say See, he too. got so many, man. And just like, the, and the, like the Samuel. stuff, the glory stuff, the stuff he did with Samuel Jackson, uh, latest oh, single what, what, what was the name of the movie? With, uh, yeah, I know you told it. Yeah, I know you told it. Mm. Peterson. Soldier. Uh, Soldier uh, Story. Soldier Story. Soldier Story. He said, Peterson, 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 Put it in the conversation. Man, Samuel, us, I think to the to the date, man, to me for Samuel, what? it's got to be negotiated for me. Got to be I negotiated. Negotiated, too. negotiated to me. Me bombing them when he steps yeah, in. Yeah. Negotiator. Yes. Then you got to say, uh, three, he had put the three shots. Oh in, man. Uh, yeah. Like, hey, listen, you know, that's that's a classic move with me. Negotiator. Then Even I got the other one where he did where he played the um the girl. Uh, is this a while ago though? Which one? Now I'm thinking about what's the one with Jamie Foxx. That was the best, best he ever acted <laughs> me when he was uh <laughs> Man, you give me Samuel Jackson, you give me oh the ep- most epic one, Pulp Fiction. Nah, you, you know what? I can't that, do man. Pulp, man. But yeah, you got- I love Pulp Fiction, man. Django, man. When he played Django, man. Yeah, yeah, he played Django. Listen, I don't care what nobody yeah. say. I don't care what nobody say about that movie. 
the movie would have been good, but if Samuel wasn't in that movie, you got to tell me got, that they, movie. That movie wouldn't have been the same if Samuel wasn't in that movie. And the movie that that Samuel Jackson done with Quentin Tarantino, yeah, all the movies was yeah. doing classic man. Yeah. Dango, um, Pulp Fiction. Um, I don't know. I don't think worked, he did. I don't think he did. Um, the one Reservoir he was, Dogs. He ain't did that. He the did. one where he was. Uh, he was a. Uh, 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 the bounty hunter. Why? Oh man! <laughs> but he do got a bad one though. <laughs> the one we the no, one, no, he got a bad one though. What? Snakes on the plane. I don't know what made him hey, do that man, movie. On plane, I don't know what made him do that cool movie. Classic, man. Man. Nah, man, listen, he it's got one. Classic, man. He got one scene. There ain't no classic. Hey, snakes on the plane. Snakes on this fucking plane. Cult classic, man. Oh man, cult listen, classic, man. Listen, man. Hey, that's a cult classic, man. It, it was it, you watched it because he was in it, but it wasn't one of the greatest. I, ones. Yeah, I'm no, it wasn't one of the greatest. It's one of them cult. The ones you know, if you watch, if you come on, you gonna watch. It. Yeah, you ain't gonna turn it. You gonna watch yeah. it. You know, what I mean? you know it was like it was one of the movies, like you know, eh, you know. But like I say, you got some great, great movies and great actors in those. Mm -hmm. So like I say, you know, hit that like, subscribe, and comment, and just check and tell us what movies we did hit on some of these actors. Well, mm -hmm. actors, like I said, we can just some of y'all favorite movies yeah. that y'all are actors that y'all like in different movies. Yeah, like I say, put them in the comment section. We can talk about them too. You know what I'm saying? This, this is, is definitely the entertainment part of the, yeah. of the podcast. Like I said, we will bring you this from time to time. Mm -hmm. Like I say, so just hit that like, subscribe, comment, and thank you to all our new subscribers, the ones who still following us, thank continue to rock too. with us, and keep watching us. And like I say, uh, we thank y'all so much, man. Thank We're you, gonna keep you. coming at you. And like I say, um, until next time, we'll see you. On the other side, peace Shut up, up deuces, peace man. down. I'll let you later, YouTube. Peace out.